these women today are so desperate for money, for help, for handouts, that they are moving extremely sloppy and they are not doing their homework, doing their due diligence on these men that they are trying to plot and play on. And it is backfiring tremendously. Now, I know you all are sitting there thinking to yourselves, like, what is Danica talking about? Well, I'm glad that you asked. Drea, who is almost 40 or is 40, recently announced that she had a baby on the way by this young NBA player by the name of Jalen. Now, Jalen, I believe, is the same exact age as Drea's oldest son, which, again, is a little bit sick if you ask me, but we're going to leave it over there. Nonetheless, Drea, in my opinion, thought that she would be able to finesse this young man that is wealthy, that is rich, that is up and coming in the uh, NBA and be able to get a baby out of him and have all of his beautiful money go to her and only her. Why? Because she thought, in my opinion, okay, that she would be his first and only baby mama. Mm, mm, mm. Come to find out, you all, Jalen not only just recently had a baby, I believe in February, okay, but he also has another woman pregnant that is due around the same time as Drea. Crazy, right? In my opinion, just me observing and peeping game, Drea understanding that you know, she's not as hot as she used to be, not as relevant as she used to be. You know, she's thinking very fast as far as, okay, what can I do to make sure that I can solidify my future? What can I do to make sure that I have, you know, some money coming in? Oh, I know. I'll go and get with this young, rich, wealthy, up and coming NBA star get pregnant by him and then be able to have a check that I do not have to split with other women because I'm going to be his first and only baby mama. And yeah, win-win, but not so fast. Come to find out, you all, Jalen Green, like I just said, just had a baby in February, and has another woman pregnant around the same time as Drea. And so I'm pretty sure that Drea is looking like what you see right here. You know, dun, dun, dun. Ah! Yes. What? You mean to tell me I have to now split my check? And what makes it even worse, you all, is the fact that these babies are all around the same ages. So not only will you have to split up that check that you thought would be all yours, but the father of your child, he's going to more than likely have to split up his time from your child to be with his other young children, to, to tend to the other new mothers. This was not a part of your plan, Drea. You cannot convince me that it was. You thought, ma'am, that you would have all of that child support money to yourself. You thought, ma'am, that you would be able to have this young man to yourself and you only be able to finesse him and manipulate him, control him. But come to find out, this young, dumb, a little boy, if you ask me, because... Jalen, I'm going to tell you right now, as your little bit sister, you're stupid, okay? It's no shade. It's no tea. It's just my strong opinion. You're stupid. You're just now starting off 
in your career and all of your money is getting ready to go to these hoes. I mean, how dumb and reckless can you be? You're out here just smashing all of these random women around the same time, you know, knowing that your livelihood could be on the line, knowing that your career could be on the line. Like all the way around, this is just trash to me. Um, and Jalen, I do think that you're dumb. You're not thinking ahead. You're not thinking about your future. You're not even thinking about your children, you know, because you're not going to be able to be there how you want to. You're not going to be able to fully uh, be involved how you would want to, because first things first, you have to make sure that you're, um, planning for your career, make sure you're in tip top shape for that. Then on top of that, you know, your, your, your children are all the same age. So if one has a basketball game or if one has cheerleading practice, you're not going to be able to make it to all of those different, you know, events. You're not going to be able to plan strategically around that. Like you can't, it's impossible. So all the way around Jalen, I know you're young, but I got to go ahead and let you know, you really messed up your life. Um, I hope that those checks don't run out. I hope that your money keeps flowing in because you're going to need it, sir. You're really going to need it. Um, and just to be honest with you, uh, Jalen, these hoes are reckless. They don't care about you. All they care about is your money. Okay. And they will, if push comes to shove, try to get even more out of you than maybe you're going to be demanded. And what I mean by that is this, we already know that when it comes to women in general, right, a lot of women can be very catty and very jealous and very emotional. And to add into the equation, new moms to where they just had babies, right? Which means that their hormones are going to be all over the place. They're going to be very emotional and all of that. Jalen, if you just so happen to spend more time with one woman and her baby, and you're giving one woman more money or more attention and, and all of that to her and her baby, you got to know that those other women can become very jealous, very um, manipulative, very controlling, very irrational, and try their best to ruin you. Oh, you're wanting to spend more time and money over there with those kids, with those women? Okay, well, I'm going to go to the courts to see if they can up my payments. Whatever. Best believe they'll do whatever. They'll even go as far as trying to slander your name. You name it. So all the way around, Jalen, epic fail, epic ill. Sorry, little brother, but you dumb, okay? But let's get into this, you all. Y'all like the video, share the video, and subscribe. I know that Drea was absolutely livid when she found out that Jalen had other women pregnant at the same time as her and that he just had a baby. So all of that money that she was counting that she thought was going to go all to her, yeah, I, I know she's upset, okay? That one million she was planning on getting every month just went to 200,000 real quick. <laughs> but let's get into it, y'all. Y'all like the video, share the video, and subscribe. A bottle girl that met NBA player Jalen Green last year claimed she gave birth to his daughter. She claims they're still together and that he bought her a place in his building and that she's Jalen's first baby mama. So it looks like Dre is not going to be his first baby mama or his only baby mama. And Dre is not the only woman that he's messing with. Now, allegedly, another girl came forward claiming that she's pregnant as well. And she's due right around the time Dre is due as well. Three baby mamas in less 12. than months. That's got to be a new NBA record. So this Houston model slash bartender implies that she had Jalen Green's baby a few months ago 
while another dancer claims she is pregnant and expecting a child, the same due date as Drea Michelle. And Jalen Green also allegedly just welcomed a baby with a Houston model just a few months but ago. But I noticed on her page, she just recently posted a baby was born in February of 2024. And as of recently, a new woman who is a dancer is currently claiming that she is pregnant with Jalen Green's baby and the due date is expected the same exact due date as Drea Michelle's baby. If this is true, Jalen Green would have three kids by three baby mamas in less than 12 months. This could be fuel for Jalen Green's recent gameplay as he scored an average 26.5 points 5.9 rebounds and 3.4 assists in his last 10 games. Fans are saying he's playing so hard so he can increase his paycheck because he knows he's got three kids in the future and three child support payments possibly. Oh, is that so, Jalen? Let me tell you something, brother. You better be out here playing for your life. Do you understand me? You better be out here making sure that you stay in the league, that you stay making a whole bunch of money. Because I'm going to tell you right now, baby brother, okay, um, you're going to need it. You're absolutely going to need it. If you think that these women are not going to take all your money, okay, yeah, you, you better keep on averaging those 26 points. Look, if you think these women are not going to take all of your money. You got another thing coming, brother. If you're not careful, Jalen, you will be broke within the next five years. That's how bad it is out here. And you already know the more money that you make, the more money that they will take from you to give to the mother of your children to provide for them. So you better be doing your best to make sure that you keep money going and flowing in, because I'm going to tell you right now, it's only going to get worse. And Drea, Paula Tink Tink, Drea, I know you are extremely upset about this, okay? I know that your plan backfired on you. I know that you thought that, yeah, I would, I would finally be able to, you know, spruce up my resume, right i'm done being a old washed up dried up you know for the streets cougar baby mm -hmm. I'm, I'm done with that it's time for me to get back in the game and get the spotlight on me and this is the best way to do it let me go ahead and pray on this little boy who's up and coming and be able to get my money off of him get my relevance off of him and baby you're not the only one Drea. You're not the only one, Drea. You're not the first baby mama. You're not the only baby mama. Look, there's three of y'all. Whoopsie. There's three of y'all. So, Drea, you got to be more careful. Look here, ladies. <laughs> this is the downside of trying to play on and manipulate little boys okay let me look up how old um Jalen is he's 22. Drea you're sick Drea you're 39 knocking on 40 you're sick this is the downside of what you tried to do Drea Jalen is a very young man which means he's more than likely not going to be as disciplined He's not going to be as thought out and wise. And so he can be very reckless. And that can ultimately come back on you as the mother of his child because he's not going to be all there in more ways than one. He's not going to be all there mentally, emotionally, physically, and especially financially, clearly. He's willy-nilly with his pain, okay? He's not going to have the foresight that he would need in order to navigate life strategically and better. You know, so that's the downside to what you did. Ladies, y'all got to be careful. All right. Um, now, I will say this before I wrap it up. And again, y'all like the video, show the video and subscribe. 
ladies, this is why it is imperative that we do things the right way the first time. Don't be out here sleeping around with all these different entertainers, all these different rappers and, you know, sports players. Don't do that. Don't create such a bad rep for yourself, you know, and then down the line want to find somebody to clean you up and rescue you and save you. It can backfire on you because those very men that you want to be with, they see you as a threat. They see you as a liability and they're not going to touch you. Why? Because I already see your reputation. I already see what you're about. No man wants a woman that is ran through. They just don't. They don't want a woman that's for the streets. Because at any given time, you can go back to the streets. And all of my time, money, love, and support was in vain. So a lot of men are trying to protect themselves in that way. So they're not going to touch you. So what you need to do, ladies, is not be like Drea. And fellas, do not be like Jalen. This is just dumb. But don't be like Drea. Instead, if you find a good man, you know, go ahead. Build with him. I'm not saying build him up. Build with him while you're young, ladies. And that way, you all can be solid. You all can be great, you know, once you are hitting the later years in your life. You won't have to be out here scrambling, trying to figure out what little boy you can finesse out of a bag and then it backfire on you. You don't want to be living like this. This is this is terrible. You know, especially if you're older, like Drea should be solidified right now. She should not even be having to pump out all these damn kids just for a chick. And she definitely shouldn't have to be dealing with a little boy that's the same age as her son. Drea should be settled down with the older, mature man living her best life, not trying to be a come up baby mama. Joke's on you, Drea. I know you didn't see this coming, but y'all let me know how, how y'all feel about this. Um, do you feel sorry for Jalen? Um, do you feel sorry for Drea? Me personally, I don't feel sorry for either one of them. Um, I will have a little bit more uh, empathy and sympathy for Jalen because he is young. And I understand that when you are young, you can be a little reckless and everything. But nonetheless, we're old enough to know how to prevent babies and, you know, how to be wise, especially when we are starting off in our career. You know, all of your money, Jalen, is going to be gone. I'm just going to be honest with you. So you better keep on playing your hardest and playing your best to make sure that that check is coming in because you're absolutely going to need it, sir. Absolutely. And you better hope that no team drops you because that also happens. A lot of these NBA uh, players, they start off real hot and real fresh. And then before you know it, because they're so reckless, they end up, you know, falling off and then they get dropped. So be careful with this. But again, y'all let me know how I feel about this. Um, and y'all like the video, share the video, and subscribe. I'm going to see y'all in the next dope discussion. Andrea, mm, gots to be more careful. Peace.